threw it right through the stained glass window over there. Father Guy Shaka holds the concrete slab. Well, it's probably no more than five pounds, that's for sure. That came flying through the window of East Boston's Sacred Heart Parish Monday night. I came running over and uh, the detectives were here. Uh, there were some officers here. In addition to the smashed window, the front doors had been covered in graffiti. There was what looks like the number eight written on all the doors. Now, I don't know if she, they, if she meant to put the number eight or an infinity sign, whatever it was, I don't know. Investigators told Father Shaka witnesses saw the culprit in action. They saw a woman standing in front of the church. They saw her holding an object, which she then hurled through the stained glass window. Many residents in the area are disgusted. Don't be a jerk. Come on. There's so much tension right now in the world, whatever you believe in, but this is just... Come on, guys, grow up. Father Shaka says the church will make the repairs, but does have a request for the public. Well, the only thing that we can do at this point right now is just pray for the person who did this, you know, that this person will find some kind of peace. All right, now Father Shaka tells me it could take up to three months to replace that window because of the stained glass. And again, when I ask if there's any way for people to help, maybe to contribute, he just suggested that people pray for the woman responsible. Now, as for that woman tonight, there's no word on any arrests. Reporting live in East Boston, Nicole Burley, WCVB News Center 5.